Well, hello there. Seems like it's been forever since I last made a video on Astrophotography Tool. Anyways, I just want to sh go through some of the main settings with you. So I'll start up Astrophotography Tool. There it comes. Give it a second. I just downloaded the new version 3.63. Anyways, here's the screen. It automatically connected my camera, which is the ZWO ASI 1600 Pro. And the settings is over here under the tools menu. And you see APT settings. And you click on it. And you'll see where it starts off with the main settings, the skin color. When you first download or turn on APT, it'll probably be a red, you know, the red skin color, that's the default one, but you can change it to these other colors if you want. I like green, personally. Uh, it's better in the daylight, too, the green is. Anyways, some of these other settings I just haven't really had to mess around with. Uh, over here, the image path. This is where it's going to save uh, your files that, or the files and the images that it collects. Next, the CCD uh, button. Uh, I left pretty much everything else uh, as as a default setting. I think I had to change a couple of these things. I'm not sure, but if it's not these, these are what I use, and I've been having good luck with these settings temperature and sky I keep it in Celsius and I haven't had to mess around with any of these other uh, values here I just leave it the same location I'm in the northern hemisphere the happy frog observatory that's the you know, that's my backyard uh, astronomy shed <laughs> and so that's my home <laughs> and I change my latitude and longitude I'm at 41 degrees uh, north latitude and 73 degrees west longitude. And the elevation is 168, 169 meters. And time zone is uh, negative 5. Okay, scope and focuser. I haven't had to do anything here. The reason is, is I have a, uh, I don't have an automatic focuser. I have a manual focuser, so I really don't have anything to worry about with uh, this screen but if you do have an automatic focuser you would certainly adjust all your settings right here. Filter wheel, I do have an, an electronic uh, filter wheel on eight positions so uh, this is where you fill in the names uh, luminosity is the first filter, uh, second one red, three is green, filter four is blue, filter five is HA, filter six is oxygen seven is sulfur and eight I don't have any filter. If I did have an electronic focuser I would be able to have it adjust the uh, steps and I would do that right here. Each filter may or may not be parfocal. Uh, they say most some of these filter sets are supposed to be parfocal but they're not and so you can do minor adjustments right in here and have the astrophotography do tool do it automatically. Sound, uh, it comes with a female voice, or at least mine did when you first download it, but you can change it to a male voice uh, or do whatever right in this screen. I just left it as default with the female voice. I kind of like it. Planetarium, if you have a planetarium software, you can have it also work with astrophotography tool right here, and you'll notice I have the Stellarium button pressed. And last but not least, uh, advanced. I haven't had to mess around with this at all. I left it on its default settings. I do have it automatically connect to my DSLR whenever I connect uh, that. And I don't know if that was default or, or if I adjusted it. But anyways, if I put the my DSLR up here, it'll connect it automatically as well. Anyways. That's all. Hope this helps. See you later.